Good morning everyone, welcome back all the balloon fans and today I'm going to show you uh, that my third versions of the balloon swap so that you can have more varieties when you do uh, your performance or perhaps that you already start to open up some booth so that you can sell more balloon sculpture and let me share with you my experience that customer like to see more variations and you're going to play along with uh, the variations of your twisting with just a little bit of adjustment and it will create a big impact and then uh, you're going to play along with the different colors to make your uh, your sculpture uh, have a little bit of uh, attractions and varieties all right so today we're going to learn uh, we call it as a uh, stroke, short stroke or maybe I will say that um, in uh, Malaysian terms that uh, we have uh, some uh, Chris, uh, K E R I S, Chris Melayu, uh, is one. This one actually is a what we call it a traditional sword that uh, the warriors, uh, uh, Malay warriors have uh, in the fighting last time, and actually is a uh, one of the noble uh, weapon that um, our Malaysians have, and but it's all right that uh, you can uh, name it uh, yourself. Uh, about this is because this is your creations and you're going to have fun have fun with that all right so we're going to start uh same one with our hand pump and our balloons okay and you're going to start making some inflations okay but for this one i think you uh you can leave the tail is a uh, little bit little bit longer because we're going to cut it off later on so a little bit longer of tails um, and then you just tie it off again the heads all right and we're going to start from the this side okay you're going to twist yourself one inch bubbles all right and then you're going to follow doing a small loop small one i think is about over here uh, is about two inch all right small loop and then you're going to lock this one so we look like this you see that okay and then you're going to push this uh, the the small bubble to the middle of the loop okay so that it will stay at the middle okay and then you're going to leave this part because this part is the uh, holding part or you, that you're going to hold the sword okay and then I'm going to twist uh, the other lock over here make sure that this one you are uh, you got some place to hold and then uh, I'm going to twist uh, about two inch over here okay two inch of the bubble and then one inch and then two inch pin so do you see that something like this and then these two is uh it's the same sizes and then this one is the middle and then we're going to lock this together so it will look like this all right and then we're going to do the same thing all over again uh two inch and then a bubble and then two inch again okay and then lock it all together again okay. so it's a more smaller swatch okay and then you can see that there is uh, some excess over here and what you can do is you just start it off okay and then you can just have some scissors to cut it off all right okay so i'm going to add a little bit because uh crease malayu or the small sword is normally is something like this uh, so i'm going to just make it bend a bit okay bend it a bit so you can see that uh, for this side, actually uh, you can lock the lock the small bubble over here. These two, or uh, you don't want to lock it, it's alright for you. But uh, most most of 
time I would like to lock it. Okay. Because it, it looks better for me. Okay. So we are ready to go. So this one is the the, the other versions of the uh, short sword that you have or so we call it a uh, uh, some warrior sword uh, name it as you like uh, because that is your creations and that is your toys so make sure that you and uh, your audience having fun with everything that you do and please share it to your friends to your family member to any other other people that love balloons so when you do this uh, you're going to practice more uh, with the variation because uh, I will teach you three kind of uh, balloon dogs or uh, balloon doggies or some puppies and right now you already learn another three three versions of the sword so make sure that uh, you practice it and then uh, while practicing it you're going to have a lot of balloons in your room or some <laughs> some living room uh, so what you're going to do is please don't uh, throw it away just share it with uh, uh, everyone that you know all right so thank you so much for watching this video log again and i'm going to show you more variations of the uh, variety of the twisting uh, with the, some designs that you learn um, and then i hope that you have fun with it okay thank you so much see you again in the next video log bye